not a yes or no question. It's we we're talking. Yeah, it's not a yes or no. It's either or. It's an either. But you know what theology is. You know when you go to or the no. faculty of theology, you don't ask yes or no. You have to go through a whole yes no. to answer. You can't go yes or no. It's not binary. Adam Kadmon is the spiritual Adam. It's a woman addressing to Adam Kadmon. I need someone, any, anybody, to show me where it is that Muhammad is mentioned by Jesus. Where do we find the statement where Jesus mentions Ahmed? If someone can show me that, if someone can legitimately show me an authentic scripture where Jesus himself mentions the coming of Ahmed after him, his description or his name, whatever, I don't care, I'm giving you the leeway. Jesus himself, one unambiguous verse, one unequivocal statement where Jesus, peace be upon him himself, says, Ahmed will come after me. Just one, just one unequivocal verse, one unambiguous statement where Jesus Christ, peace be upon him himself, says, Ahmed comes after me. That's all I want. That's all, that's literally. That's all I want. A few moments later. So, uh, do you understand Hebrew? Because I'm going to quote in Hebrew. Uh, okay, you, you, can, you can quote it in, uh, you can quote it in, in English. It's okay. Okay. But I'll do it in, in, in Hebrew because it's relevant and then in English. Hiko Montakim, the Kolo Mohammedem, Zadudi Zarei, that's Jesus speaking. Uh, isn't isn't the logos the word of God? Isn't it supposed to be Jesus? Supposed to be Jesus in John one one or Johanna? What, what did I ask, Vincent? You asked me to tell you where Jesus mentioned Muhammad, and I just told you. He so, so Jesus. I'm confused. They so Jesus is, Jesus is speaking in in Song of Solomon. Yeah, five sixteen. Jesus is speaking. Can you, you can, can you show me where Jesus is speaking in Song of Solomon, chapter 5? So you're telling me that Song of, of Song isn't the word of God. So it's not the Logos. Oh, so, wait, so, it's not so Jesus. You're, so you're agreeing that Jesus... Question. Wait, just, just to be clear. You're agreeing that Jesus is God? No. Uh, as a... Um, following the Christian narrative, Jesus... It's not, it's not a Christian narrative. Jesus it's, is it's, included in the Trinity, right? It's, it's, not, it's not about a Christian narrative. You're using this. No, as I'm a Muslim. Proof. You know I'm a Muslim, right? I, I know. So I'm asking you to show me where Jesus mentioned Ahmed to come. And you're saying that, yes, I'm showing you here. This is where Jesus mentioned Ahmed. And you're saying that this is God speaking. So Jesus is God, according to Song of Solomon? According to the Christian narrative, you have three Akanim. Or three, I don't know how you call this in English, the three hypostasis, I believe that's how you pronounce it. So right? you believe that Jesus is God? No, I believe he's a Hamashiach, a Messiah, and I so, believe he's so that, a prophet. So, so, so is God speaking or is Jesus speaking in Song of Solomon? Following the Christian narrative, the Lord is the Christian word narrative. Of, uh, I'm, yeah, but I'm, I'm, a asking, Christ, I'm not a Christian. It's very, it's very I'm, simple. I'm it's very simple. Is God speaking in Song of Solomon chapter 5 or is Jesus? According to you believe, you... Don't say according to my belief. So. I don't That's believe so, Vincent, but you Vincent, believe Vincent. so, right? This isn't going to last long if we can't be honest with each other, okay? I'm asking yeah, something I'm very talking, simple again. I'm is, I'm is, Jesus speaking, of is Jesus not... speaking in Song Listen. of Solomon chapter 5 or is God speaking in Song of Solomon chapter it. 5 according to you? It's not a yes or no question. It's, we we're talking. Yeah, it's not a yes or no. It's either or. It's like either. God you know what theology is. You know when you go to the no. faculty of theology, you don't ask yes or no. You have to go through a whole spectrum to answer. You can't go yes or no. It's not binary. Well, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, you do. So it's it's again, it's very simple. Um, As a Muslim, no logic. Um, isn't this uh, gentleman supposed to be proving uh, um, that Jesus? Uh, prophesized a person named Ahmed. Um, so now we're going to the Songs of Solomon, and now he's trying to debate his own argument. 
all we're asking for, right. brothers, where Jesus said Ahmed. <laughs> That's all we're asking for, man. Right. I, I mean, like I was I was going to ask you, Avery. I mean, if, if we're going to go to this passage, um, was Jesus a woman? Well, what a question. Why do you want Jesus to be a woman to begin with? That, that, that's that's the complete opposite of what I'm, in, I'm intending to do. But I'm asking you, Vincent, if you've read the bloody Hebrew. Vincent, listen to my question. Listen to my question. You don't speak Hebrew. Is Vincent, answer my question because you know you're caught. Is Jesus a woman? You can't make this up. No, he's not. Obviously. Then who is speaking in the Song of Solomon? Because the Song okay. of Solomon okay. is talking about a woman's lover and her well, friend. So did Jesus, so did Jesus have a lover who's okay, male? Let me answer. The woman you're talking about, she's addressing to Adam Kadmon. Adam Kadmon is the spiritual Adam. Adam in Hebrew means uh, <laughs> one of five. No, it's, it's, it's very true. Can you Google no, Adam no, Kadmon? He, what did he just say? Do you know who's Vincent, Adam Kadmon? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have to stop you right there. I'm going to have to stop you right there. Because the text says, this is my lover, this is my friend, O oh, daughters of Jerusalem. Yeah, but oh, not your setting. He's not. I he's know. not talking. He's not talking to any spiritual Adam or any spiritual yes, man. He is. The, te the text. Tells yes, he you. is. Well, so, 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 finish, so, finish, finish the verse. Yeah, I, I'm honestly, I, 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 I couldn't care less about us giving him the correct interpretation of this. If right. he wants to believe that Jesus is a woman who's prophesying about Muhammad. So be it. Is, do you affirm that, that Jesus is a woman that prophesies about Muhammad? I'm not saying that. That's a distortion that you want to attribute to me. So, what I'm okay, saying okay. is that the Bible so, is supposed to be so the who, word of God. So who's speaking, Vincent? Okay, is Isaiah Jesus? Because Isaiah is Vincent, mentioned in the speaking? Bible, right? Vincent, it's who's speaking? Logic. Okay, when you read two kings, do you believe it's Jesus? Vincent, Vincent I'm going to give you one last it's chance insane. to answer the question and I'm moving on. You have one, you have one more chance. I just Who gave you an answer, but you don't like the answer. Solomon 5. It's a woman addressing to Adam Kadmon. Adam Kadmon is the spiritual Adam. This spiritual man could be Muhammad Johnson in. Okay, so it's a Bangkok woman song. speaking. Okay, thank you. Thank, thank you so much. You're so welcome. it's a woman speaking. So it's not Jesus speaking, then, correct? What I'm saying is that following the Christian narrative, Song if it's a of woman song speaking, is the word of God. It's not Jesus speaking, okay, correct? is is Isaiah the word of God? If or it's is not Isaiah a woman Jesus speaking, God? if it's not a woman speak, if it's a woman speaking, then it's not Jesus speaking, correct? Okay, I got your point. What I'm saying is the Answer word the of question, God. Then, if you got my point, there's different figures in the Bible. If you have my point, answer the question. I'm, I'm done. Bad. Maybe I was a little too quick on that one. Logic. No, I figured you weren't. I figured yeah, on the fourth weren't. attempt, he needed to go. Y'all, we can't make this up. You can't make it up. We man. can't. 